I'm Dr. Ider Kikianti. Uh, most of my students call me Dr. K. Short and sweet, I guess. So let's just go with that. So um, in this series, we're going to try something new on our YouTube channel. We're going to go through this book, um, How to Think Like a Mathematician by Kevin Houston. Let me put it closer to the screen so you can see uh, the book a little bit. Um, the book is quite nice um, and primarily talking about uh, three major things, how to read mathematics, how to write mathematics, and a big chunk of it is how to do proofs. Um, so we think that it might be useful for a lot of our students studying mathematics, even if you're not studying mathematics, um, a skill, sort of study skills to um, uh, learn uh, math mathematics in your mathematics module, maybe you're doing engineering or you're doing some other degree that requires mathematics. Um, maybe this will be useful for you. So throughout the series, we're going to um, talk about how to read mathematics, how to write mathematics. Those two are going to be fairly short. Um, and the chunk of the series will focus on how to prove mathematics. So before we start, I just want to um, read a couple things from the preface because I think this is uh, quite nice. So the book starts with a um, course talking about how beautiful mathematics is, how useful it is, and so on and so forth, which is absolutely true, by the way. Um, but it also has some friendly advice for those of you who are studying mathematics, so I'm just going to read it to you. Um, some friendly advice that you have probably heard before when you're studying mathematics, worth repeating, said this book, is that, well, first of all, it is all up to you. So um, the teacher can open the door, but you must enter by yourself. So you are basically the greatest determiner for your success in your studies. Um, be active. So read the book, do the exercises. I think all the lectures um, say the same thing. Think for yourself, always a good advice. Um, question everything. So you need to be skeptical of the results presented to you. Um, don't accept them until you believe them. Okay, um, observe. So observe what your lecturers are doing, how they, um, how they present something, how they are um, uh, trying to solve problems, uh, how do they approach it, and so on and so forth. And this probably going to shock you. Um, prepare to be wrong. Uh, don't be scared to make mistakes. We all make mistakes. I don't know how many mistakes I made throughout my undergraduate, but that's basically where I learned. Um, after you do something, you made a mistake, and you think to yourself, okay, that's not how to do it. And actually gain insightful um, information for yourself where you need to um, fix and improve. Okay, And sometimes even to um, make it clearer to yourself what the, uh, what the meaning of, uh, of the work is. Okay, Don't memorize, seek to understand. All of your lectures say this. This is the point of studying mathematics is not to memorize but to understand uh, what we're doing, what it is all about. So those definitions and theorems, they're very, very important. Okay, uh, Develop your intuition, but don't trust it completely. So uh, we always say this in class, um, use your intuition sometimes, um, drawing pictures help and so on, but sometimes they can also be misleading. So um, you need to really practice a lot and then try to develop this so-called mathematical intuition, but sometimes things may go wrong. Um, collaborate, work with your friends. I think there's no more I can say on that one. And finally, reflect. Look back and see what you have learned. Okay, so that's uh, the advice from this book on how to study mathematics. We'll go through the series a little bit more uh, in details about reading, as I said, uh, <laughs> as I mentioned earlier, um, reading mathematics, um, writing mathematics, and most importantly, proving mathematics. So I will make a series of short videos on, um, on each of these topics, and the proof portion will probably be many, many videos um, of various topics. Okay, I look forward to starting the series and hope you enjoy it and you will also benefit from them. Bye!